Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Okay, so we are now gonna go into the Crystal Palace. It's lunchtime. I am hungry. Are you hungry? I am very hungry. All right, let's go. Okay, so we are back here. Your seers have done the breakfast one. We are now going for the lunch. So you, just to show you what we can get, you can get uh, the different house rolls with whipped butter as well. Uh, these are the pretzel rolls. They also have the, uh, uh, I think these are sort of bread rolls as well. Ketchup, they've got all kinds of salad you can have. You can have that with cheese, tomato, sliced carrots, uh, I think that's blue cheese right there, and they also have uh, cucumber and uh, onions. They also have a selection of fresh fruit salad. You can have the pasta salad and the Mediterranean couscous. They do do a chickpea salad, three bean salad, and you can get the shrimp. So they have the country fried chicken, the mash, which looks tremendous. I'm gonna take some of this mash onto here, although I made a bit of a mess. They've got the uh, braised collard greens with smoked ham hocks. They have the broccoli, which I'm gonna take some of. I absolutely love broccoli. So I'm gonna have plenty of this. They have the roasted marble potato, the roasted marble potato, which Kelly's having some of now. They have the glazed roast carrots. These look incredible. Uh, the smoked cheddar grits and the shrimp creole. They have the white rice. They have the vegetable chana masala. Uh, they have the honey glazed salmon. This looks really, really good. I'm gonna take some of this. That looks good, that looks good. They will bring more out. Remember, this is buffets. You can have as much as you like, which I will do. Oh, and they have the full cheese mac and cheese. They also have the oven roast chicken and the Ropa Vieja. I'm not sure what that is, but uh, I probably butchered that. It's Ropa, is it Vieja? There we are. Right, you can also have the sausage gravy and the wine jus. They also have the whole radishes cream sauce. So they also do here the roast carved beef, the pork loin, and the beef there, which Kelly's just getting some there. Wow, look at that. So there you go, that is the menu they've got here. So that is the menu that they have here. I'll show you the kids menu, just in case you fancy some of that. They've got the crispy tenders, the mac and cheese, kids mac and cheese, the miniature baked quesadilla, and the cheesy bread, which is mini pizzas. I'm gonna try one of these. Yeah, I'm gonna try one too.
Okay, so this food looks incredible. As you know, we are doing the lunchtime service. Uh, I've got mine, Kelly's got hers. There's a lot of, we went for the meat in the end. Yeah, I did this time, um, but don't forget, when we came, we came for breakfast last time, so I ate quite a bit. So um, I tried not to fill my plate up, but by the time you take a little bit of everything, this is the result of the plate, so yeah. Looks good. Right, we're going to try this out. Now, we will get characters coming around yes. as we eat, so we will interrupt the uh, tasting just to meet the characters so you can see who's here. Hey. Okay, so Teddy's going to go first. I'm going to go for this cheesy pizza because it looks amazing. Right, it's very noisy in here, guys, so apologies. That's so good. Is it good? Yeah. Are you sure it's cheesy? I hope so. Is there meat in it? Oh right, okay, I can't have that then. You'll have to have that one for me. Oh, I was really looking forward to trying that as well. Okay. So, this is from the kids menu. So, this is the chicken nugget. Very good. Really enjoying that. the chicken one. I thought some nice rainbow veg. Oh, I saw that the carrots. Mm. You got a ton of ketchup there as well. Right? Okay. Good. Good. Oh wow, those honey glazed carrots I must say did look amazing. I got myself some of these as well. Um I also got some honey mustard. Okay. I don't think I had a honey mustard so I didn't get myself any sides on this one. No, Sauces, I should say. Potato. Okay. Honey mustard is good as well. I'm not sure. It's nice. But I'm not sure if I would choose it over, let's say, mayo or ketchup, but it is good. Okay. I went for a little bit of salmon. Oh, the salmon looked incredible. Yeah. The trouble is with these buffets is I always mistime it. I always go right when they've run out. So they've got the dregs of whatever they got there. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Right, gonna try the mac and cheese. Now as many of you know I can take all the mac and cheese, mac and cheese, but I saw it then I thought, you know what? Now, just for my fellow veggies, the pescatarians, they do a full cheese mac and cheese here. This is the kids one, which Kelly said is good. The full cheese one has bacon on it, so I did check, so just yeah. be wary of that. Alright. Now, I asked for the more cooked side of the beef. Ah, okay. Now, you saw Kelly take that from the uh, meat station. So, this is the beef. But you did ask for it that way. But I don't, I like it more cooked than the less cooked, if that makes sense. They will do it uh, tender if you want it. Oh, what's this? No. Is this the pork? This is the pork. Now, she was coming to the end of that pork, so I know this is going to be dry. Well, you, when you go up again, you can get a fresher slice. I won't, I won't be able to, but, because I, I know I won't be able to eat after this, but I'm going to try it nonetheless. Like I said, slightly overdone. Well, not slightly overdone, very overdone. But it's fine. Well, oh, that's a bit of a shame. But with bear in mind, so yeah, it really depends on. You can ask though for your pork done yeah. different ways, I mean. You can ask. So there was a pressure pork there. So she was trying to get rid of the yeah, that one last that had bit. Been sitting there, which is obvious, which is fine. So. I just took the bit, but there was a fresh pork there if you wanted it from the fresher. Right, this is the chicken tender. Yeah, this is the punch and fried chicken. Yeah. Good. Good. Mm. I really wanted fried chicken. And this is really good. It's not as, it's not the best fried chicken that I've ever had, but it is nice. More. Yeah, so remember you can have as much of this as you like. Mm -hmm. Right, I think the last thing you've got to try is that roll. I know. Which is buried under your meat mountain. Yeah, I don't think I can... Yeah. I did put mine on a separate plate, which you yeah, can put you on do. mine if you want. 
Right, now they are several types of rolls they have up there. The pretzel one looked most appealing to me too. And that whip butter is tremendous. I've never seen anyone eat <laughs> a roll like that, please. Well, the pretzel's so full, it's not hot. It's salty, but because I've got other flavours, I can't taste that whole pretzel taste. I might start with the pretzel bread then when I do mine. The pretzel is soft, you can tell. That is so. Very, very nice. Yeah. Now it's master. Alright, so who bears me be here any minute now? So we will, we will do it in a second. I'm going to start with the roll. Mm. Right. <laughs> that roll is right. delicious. Now, they keep it cool. So it's fresh, um, because when you cool bread it goes a bit, not hard, but more solid, but it's delicious. It's a really, the whipped butter, uh, we don't really have whipped butter in the UK. So that is so light and fluffy. Right, okay, yeah. let me try some of these. So this is the carrots. This is the thing I'm going to show you. Why? They're delicious. Right. It's almost like they've got honey on them. Mm. So good. That's really, really good. Bit of the mash. That's really nice. Yeah. It's a lot creamier this yes, time. Yes, yes it is. It's yeah. a bit more runnier, but it's actually nice. I do like it. Um, with the broccoli. They really salt the water for the fruit. I don't tend to do that with my cooking, but I do like it. I'm going to get addicted to salty water now. Okay. okay. Those potatoes are delicious. Yeah, they are. These are the roast. Look at those. They're, They're my favourite potatoes. I think they roast them in the olive oil. Right, right. right. So I try and... I'm nearly lost them then. This is a shrimp. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't take any of that. Mm. That's really, really good. Right, we're going to pause right here. Right there, okay. <laughs> oh, no, we've done uh, Pooh's one and off, so we will come back to that. Another one of those potatoes, they're so good. Uh -huh. Now I'm going to be doing, this is the salmon. I managed to get a piece inside of the salmon with the glaze. Wow. That glaze is so sticky, but it complements the, um, the salmon really, really well. The salmon's really well cooked. That's really, really good. Now, I'm going to go for the kids' mac and cheese. I did want to try the four season, but I didn't see that. Oh, wow. Okay. Kelly's I had her eyes on the meat right here. <laughs> things do you know what I mean there while I was walking past but to be fair this mac and cheese is what I had in most of the other places yeah. it's really really good yeah overall that meal is really really good if you are vegetarian though strict vegetarian which I'm not I do have the fish you'll have less options out there just to warn you yeah you're literally going to vegetables and not much else which is yeah. a bit of a shame but the the fish is really really good for um, they do a separate menu of which we don't know about. They did ask if there's any allergens, I said no. Yeah. Um, but this is tremendous, really enjoy it. Oh, Poo's. Oh. Okay, so I've got my next plate. Let's take it back to the table. So I got my second plate, I probably got way more than I should have done, but the food is just so good here. And I did double check, this is just a cheese pizza, no meat in it. So I did double check with the chef. So I am going to enjoy eating this. Okay, this is sheer piggery now, but I really do like the food here. So I want to try this because um, this is just a cheese pizza. 
It's good. I wanted to get this one. They've just pulled it out, so it's wow. really, really hot. Wow. I know it's a kiddies one, but it's... <laughs> 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 That's really good. I need the rest of this one. Thank you. And I, I've just got another white grape. I've had two already. This is my, be my third. Is that white grape? Yeah. Oh, they got white grape? Yeah. You didn't tell me they had white grape. I did tell you they had white grape. What did you think it was? I'm going to have a sip of that because I like the white grape. Right, I have finished my second plate. That was absolutely delicious. I cannot recommend that root vegetables enough. You can see the sauce left over. If I had some bread, I would mop that up, but they do take your plate away. Um, and like I said, you've just approved that it's unlimited drinks. Um, they've just bought me up another iced, won't they? Another iced tea. So I've got plenty of that. I've Kelly. Got my bed. My, my third white grape. Kelly's third white grape. Kelly has just admitted defeat, unfortunately, but uh, we really do enjoy the food here. Now we're going to show you the desserts. Okay, so here are the desserts. They look amazing. So we've got strawberry and chocolate nut cake, carrot cheesecake, honey mousse cake. And then what looks like a uh, maybe a plant-based citrus cake, possibly. I think it's stuff. You just get everything, oh. everything, right? Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get everything. <laughs> and then you've got the pop. This is the plant-based citrus cake. This is the honeybee cake, and this is the honey mousse cake, or that is the honey mousse cake. I'm not sure what this one is then. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, this is the part of Panna Cotta Parfait. So this is the Panna Cotta Parfait. Then you've got the loaded baked brownies and you've got some cookies here which look absolutely amazing. And then you've got the soft serve ice cream which is chocolate, vanilla or swell, meaning you can have them both together, I guess. So take a look at these. They're absolutely amazing. Oh, I thought there was another side, but no, there is a side over here, which is just the exact same thing, but for this side. But yeah, if you are looking for great desserts, and there's Pooh Bear. <laughs> but yeah, these look absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna get a range. I think I'm gonna go for the carrot cake, the um, panna cotta parfait, Oh, I don't know about that honeybee flan, but I may get the fresh baked cookies and the loaded brownies. Let's see. So we're at dessert. Yeah, and you know what I realised? I should have got soft serve with the with the brownie. Oh yeah. And the cookie. So quickly talk through what you got. So I got the parfait. Yeah. I got the uh, carrot cake. I got the cookie, and I got the um, the brownie. Ah, okay, right. Which one are you going to try first? Let me try the brownie first. recommend the baked brownie. Right. So good. Okay, so that's the brownie. What next are we going to try? I'm going to try the carrot cake next. Try the carrot cake. It's good. It's not as good as the brownie. Oh really? So the brownie's king so far. Mm. So we've got the... Um, it did intrigue me, the carrot cake. I got this too. Now, when, you'll see when I get to my desserts, I chose different desserts to Kelly, just so we could try some different bits. Mm, mm. Okay, go on, next up. 
I'll go for the palm, mate. No, you don't want to take me in. I think because the brownie is so good. Oh, alright. That's the thing. When you taste something that's really good. This is it, the other sliver. others have to surpass it, right? Otherwise, the others are a bit lacklustre. Okay, and then you've got your cookie. Mm. Now, these are freshly baked, by the yeah, way. Yeah, and these are like biscuits, how I like them. Yeah, I prefer them softer, yeah, but anyway. You do. This would have been good with ice cream. Good cookie. It's soft in the middle, but not nice and crispy. And that's the sign of a good cookie. To have it crispy at the bottom and then soft in the middle. I like that. All right, now, I have just got my ones here, but I'm going to let Kelly try these because... Do you fancy trying? I'm not a fan of gelatinous stuff. All right, so that's a no then. All right. All them flan business. All right, let me try these then if she's not a fan, and then I'll tell you. Bye. Now, I will try some of Kelly's just to save time. Mm. The evil's on their way. Right, so, this is the... So this is the uh, honey flan. Yeah. I did want to try this one. See, I'm not lo a lover of creme caramel and all of that sort of thing. Mm. Yeah? That's really nice. Ah. It's got a very subtle honey taste. Honey's mm. very strong. Right. But this isn't. Nice. There's a very thin, a very, very thin flan base with that. That's delicious. I'm going to look a little bee on it. <laughs> Can you see the little bee? Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, that's delicious. It's very much like a creme caramel. Yeah, which I don't like. Hmm, but that's good. Okay, this one is that like, is another honey flan. Let me try this one. Mm. That's really good. Wow. It's very very light. Very very soft. Okay. That is good. Right, I'm going to try... This is the plant-based cake. This is the plant-based one. I want to try the plant-based cake. Hi, Eeyore. Eeyore's just Eeyore. popped in. There he is. How are you? He just tried your dessert. It was delicious. Eeyore, that's very nice. I love your dessert. It's very good. Yes. I <laughs> haven't got <laughs> <get> some more. <laughs> bye, bye. 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 Okay. Oh, so the plant base is eel. Plant base is eel, and it's actually really, really nice. It's very, very light. And you've got the. I thought it would be eel because it's got the grey um, yeah. cream on the top. And this one would represent Tigger. Yeah. And it does, you've got the carrot seed one. It's got a very slight orange taste to it as well. Mm. That's, you can see I'm eating a lot of this one. This one's really good. I was going to say, and the flan represents with the bee, I'm assuming represents Pooh Bear. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think you're probably right. See, I would have spotted that. Until yeah. You got it. Okay, this one is a character. It's good. Not as good as the one you baked. Right. But it is good. All of those, I'm going to go for the eel cake, you know. Wow. I really like the eel cake. Wow, wow, wow. That's no. the plant based one. Can I try yours? Yeah. So this represents Tigger. The only one we didn't get was Piglet. Okay, we'll get the Piglet one. Mm, I like that. Yeah. It's not too bad, okay. Now you're, you're, you're not gonna see what I'm doing, but uh, here you go, this is the cookie. No. It's warm, it's crunchy, yeah. and it's just kind of warm. I prefer the softer one. Yeah. That's more for Kelly, but I'm going to, last but not least, I'm going to try this, which is the, the gooey fudge thing. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's massive. Yeah. That's massive. You see what I'm saying? So now, when you have the other desserts, it doesn't touch but that one. we are going to be joined by Pooh, just behind oh, you. Oh, there he is. <laughs> going to have a hug? Right, so I had to do it. I had to get that that 
chocolate brownie is phenomenal. What I didn't notice, you can probably see, there's M&M pieces in there. There's a green one, there's a red shell. You can just about make out the M&M sign. Yeah, because I think it's called the loaded uh, chocolate brownie. Ah, okay. Loaded braid chocolate Loaded braid I've got some mix. You can either have vanilla, chocolate, or sw mixed swirls. So I did mixed swirl, probably because I pulled the wrong lever. It is all self-service. And we got the piglet cake. So that would have been all cakes tried once we've done the piglet cake. So we've got to do the piglet cake. Right, let me try. This is sheer piglet. And I keep saying that, so that's real bad. Okay. It's really nice. It's strawberry. It's strawberry chocolate cupcake. Strawberry chocolate. It's really good. It's very, very light. There's also tiny. Oh. You can see that. Oh yeah, there's chocolate inside it. There's chocolate inside it. Can uh, the camera can't pick it up, but yeah. But it's really, really nice. It's really, really light. It's a really good. That's one of the nicest ones. Oh. Wow. I'm gonna say the nicest one is this one. The, the yeah, the baked, uh, loaded baked. But the always comes very close. But this is delicious too. Well, I'll leave a little bit so you can try it. Ooh. I'm gonna come and just eat you. Here we go. Kelly's really stuffed, but she's gonna go for it. It's good, isn't it? It doesn't taste strawberry, but you know what it tastes? Go on. It's gonna be really weird. It tastes pink. Taste of pink. <laughs> so when you're a kid, pink flavored food. You know when you're eating things like lemon or ah um, uh, okay, delight or whatever, and it's pink. That's exactly what. I it think you mean like. raspberry. Yeah, I know what you're no. saying. It doesn't taste of raspberry. It doesn't taste of strawberry. It doesn't taste of any type of berry. It just tastes pink. A if bit you like, know, you know. Just like your top. Well, I really like that one. We are going to chow down. I'm going to have this combo now because I really want to try the combo of the two. Oh, wow. You've got the gooey, sticky, warm cake. And that ice cream. I wish I got vanilla, actually, not the swirl, because it makes it... It's chocolate and chocolate. Yeah. That makes sense, yeah. But it's really, really good. Mm. That's excellent. Right, we're going to finish this up. We'll give our final thoughts. Mm. So we've just had the bill. Uh, so for two adults for lunch, it is $122 plus $7.93 tax. So remember, this for lunch is slightly more expensive than the breakfast. But there we are. We will give you our final thoughts outside. So one of the things you do get here is a Friendship Day celebration card with signatures from all the characters there so you will get this as a souvenir as well just as a little aside right we are full we're going to go outside and then we are definitely most definitely going to give you our final thoughts well that's it guys we have finished in the crystal palace what did you think i am so full you would not believe it it was delicious the food was really really good uh, it's always a good experience at uh, crystal palace like, I'm never disappointed when I go, um, and, you know, they're really pleasant, they're really nice, you know, the characters come round, the characters are really nice, and yeah, I just, like, I enjoy the whole experience of going to the Crystal Palace, for sure. Now, one thing, uh, you may ask is, well, can I, I don't really want the character dining bit, can I do it without the, uh, character part, and the answer to that is no, you have to, obviously it's included in your bill, yeah. but... You can say, so basically a cast member will be with the uh, characters. You can say, look, could, I'm not interested, could you move on? And they will yeah. politely do that. The, the, the character might just wave at you and then move on. So yeah, you don't... it won't be any cheaper. No, that's, that's what I was trying to say. It still will cost you what it costs you. So you are yeah. paying for the food, but you are paying for the dining experience. Exactly, yeah. Um, but it is a great experience all in all. The food is good. Uh, there's lots of variety and you can you even if you prefer the kids food you can even have the kids food and the desserts are good as well so yeah well let's start from the start so what did you what was your favorite part of the main so I say the main Ooh. we didn't really go for the salad bits as you probably saw yeah I didn't want to stock up on salad I want the good stuff so what yeah, was your favorite and I didn't want to stock up on the bread even though the bread looked amazing the bread is good way. 
Um, your favourites? Oh, I liked the salmon, I liked yeah. the mash, I liked the root vegetables. Oh yeah, see, the, yeah. they were my favourite. The salmon and yeah. the root vegetables, I've got to say, were my favourite. They were in this really sticky glaze, which was yeah. delicious. So I really enjoyed it. That was my favourite. Yeah. How about the desserts? Um, the desserts were okay. I'm a bit funny when it comes to desserts. But for me, if I have to say, like, out of all of them, it would have been the brownie. And oh, for okay. those chocolate lovers out there, get that loaded brownie. You're going to love it, honestly. That was my favourite too. I mean, if for a second would have been the e or I was really pleasant to see surprised by the plant-based dessert. That was mm. really, really nice. And uh, I really like the chocolate chip cookie. That was good too. So. Yeah. We both thoroughly recommend the Crystal Palace. Yeah. It is pricey. Uh, if you want it slightly cheaper, go for the breakfast, which you'll see in our other video, which we will link into now. Uh, and then that will, you can see if you prefer that. Yeah. Anyway, we thought we'd do a little uh, outro there. I hope you enjoyed that. As always, please like, share and subscribe. It helps us make more videos and we love making videos for you guys. Uh, and don't forget, you can join us on our live chat uh, anytime, well, I say anytime, but on Tuesday and Friday at 6 30 UK time where you can talk about anything you like including what you've seen today and if you like trips tips and things reviews anything like that and you haven't subscribed then please do anyway we're on for more adventures we'll see you in the next video bye for now bye for now